Hey guys, Dr. Deuce back again with another great music tech tip for you. Now this tip is definitely going to speed things up and save you a lot of frustration. Okay, so the key command or shortcut that we'll cover today is how to use the pre-listen or preview button in the audio or sample editor window. Okay, let's get started. I want to do a bit of editing of this audio file right here. So I'm going to double click on this and let's have a quick listen to the file. Just using the mouse, I'll click this to pre-listen. So I just want to have a listen to the first few bars of this. So let's highlight this section. And if I press pre-listen, cool, that's by using the mouse. Now, one of the most frustrating things I find with Logic is once I've highlighted this, I automatically press the space bar, assuming that Logic will play back this section highlighted. So for example, if I hit the space bar now, what's happening there is Logic is playing back the whole song. Now you can hear the difference between the tempo of the arrangement and the actual sample. Let's try that again. Sample. Okay. There's definitely a big difference there. This sample is time stretched in the Logic Arrange window. So how do we get around this? Now instinctively, we go to the space bar when we want to play. Therefore, to avoid having to use the mouse all the time to press on this little speaker icon here, if you were to hold down control and now press the space bar, and again to stop, all right? So control space bar to play and stop in the audio editor. Whereas if I was to just press the space bar, I'm actually playing back the whole arrangement, okay? Now this will definitely speed things up and save you a lot of frustration when working with the audio or sample editor in Logic Pro. Hope this tip helps and don't forget to leave a comment, like and subscribe to my channel and I'll be back real soon. This is Dr. Deuce, I'm out, peace.